Welcome back guys to the walkthrough of Catherine. We are now on the second landing after the second stage and uh, there are some more sheep around. Big bucket surprise. Um, but we are going to see what we can find. Maybe they can give us some advice about construction. A totally normal sane sentence. Um, also, apparently in this landing we can actually buy items. So we're going to check out what he has. I'm assuming the giant doughboy of a sheep is actually the merchant because you can't miss him. And also he's in the front. Anyway, with that said, let's play some more. Okay, so first, let's save. As you know, that is the most important part of any game. Okay, so let's see what this merchant has for us. Oh, it's you. The white cube creates a block in front of you. Nah, I don't need Huh? You think you're window shopping or something, fro man? Uh, uh... <clears throat> Excuse me. Please come again. Your whole body is a fro, sir. I found this out just... Yo, have we met before? You survived because of the techniques I found out. Tell me something. Let me show you another great technique. All right. Allow me to explain suspending. This technique gives you more room to maneuver. Push a block off a ledge with nothing below. As long as the edges connect, the block will remain in place. I'm a regular blockologist. Oh. <laughs> hmm, that's a good start. Try to remember this one too. Allow me to explain pullback. If you climb up and find yourself stuck, try pulling a block and backing down. By creating a stairway as you go down, you will be able to go higher than you could before. You knew that? Yeah, I knew. Anyway, what I'm getting at is, this kind of stuff has to become second nature to you. I know. I can't just rely on my natural reporter's instinct. It's the truth. Just techniques, huh? I guess the trick is to learn as many of them as possible. Okay, if you find any new moves, you come straight to me. This is coming from the executive manager. So, I don't know if they're doing this on purpose or not, but as you can tell, there are certain letters and words that are actually put into red, telling you a little bit about who they used to be, um, or who they are now in the not-nightmare-sheep world. So, I don't know if that's going to be important to the story or not, um, but anyway, let's talk to more sheep and see what they say. Snap out of it. There's nothing like that anywhere near here. The monster talks. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Huh? Get it? He was talking about you. Hey, didn't you shove me just a few minutes ago? How dare you? You're just some sheep. I'll shove you next time. Wait, I heard that all the sheep here are actually people. New flash. Fuck you. <laughs> I need to make sure I survive. But that's not right. No. It's not a matter of right or wrong. It's about life and death. Yeah. What good is having pity going to do you in here? Talk to him again. No matter what happens, Maybe you'll curse at me more. Else, I'm gonna live. Nope, I guess not. More crying. What's with all the cubes? I don't understand any of this. What should I do? Please help me. Just gotta climb. Learn some techniques to get higher. Techniques? Like what? Oh, come on, teach me. Anything. Maybe this will help. 
Allow me to explain the tornado. Oh, the tornado. If blocks are stacked all over the place, calm down and pull them out one by one. That is actually kind of a complicated maneuver. Um, just when you're doing this, make sure not to press circle because that will actually drop you from the edge before you even have a chance to go around it. Move them aside and bring them down like a tornado. Then make a staircase and climb. Whoa! Is that how you climb? Wow! You're amazing! Oh, I think I can go on a little longer! Great, you just saved the sheep. I'm thinking about that technique you showed me, so I won't forget. Sorry, I gotta go. Good luck. I saw a sheep fall past me on my way up. I, I can't get that scream out of my head. It won't go away. All you'll hear is your own death scream. You can stay here. And even this place will fall eventually. Oh, there's another guy. It's that sheep again. I gotta play dead. I'm not a sheep. All the sheep here are really human. Really? What? Really? I, I just pushed two sheep a little while ago. Well, you are a monster. I found this out just now. Okay, I can talk to the oh, guy. Right, the glasses, uh... We found a landing of sorts here, so we should expect there to be other sets of stairs. Don't tell me we've got to go through this tomorrow, and the day after, and... Third time's the charm, right? <sighs> I found this out just now. Great. Well, seeing how we talked to everyone, um... Just in case, let's just save so we don't have to deal with all of that information again. Okay, so we are successful in our save. Good for you. I don't know why I didn't get a trophy, but I'm a bit offended. Uh, hey. I told you, sit down first. Traditionalists. Oh. You're here, Lost Lamb. He'll be answering another of my questions. I've had enough of this. A man's worth can't be measured by a single question. This is the second question. Do you feel more anxious when you're alone or when among many people? Uh, this Which is... One? Once again, this is one of those questions that don't actually question your values on a certain topic, but really it's just a personal question about uh, whether you're nervous being alone or being with others. Oh, no. um, I actually don't know. Uh, Which one? I guess I'm more nervous with being with others. But not in Which the one? sense of uh, being self-conscious. So I'm just going to pick being alone. Because that's not necessarily true. But I mean, if I have to make a choice, so I just have to. Answer. I see. I'll answer your question this time, little lost lamb. This entire place is an immense sanctuary. There are eight floors. This is the second night, and only the second floor. Wait, does that mean there's an end to this? If I can get to the end, I don't have to die? Don't get your hopes up. You'll never be able to reach the pinnacle. Anyway, listen. I hear the sounds of your night terrors approaching. <laughs> are you ready? I like that laugh. What the hell's going on here? Well, I guess something big is about to happen. Um, I'm sure you can guess what it is. I'm sure it's absolutely terrifying. But that is the end of this video. Oh, wait, we have to see the answer for all of our questions. Okay. Alright, people are more nervous of being with others than being alone. Uh, internet poll of people ages 20 to 40, men only. Interesting. Uh, it says I'm offline, unfortunately. So that means that this is just a statistic that they got from, uh, I guess, just their normal independent poll off the internet. 
Uh, anyway, this will be the end of this video. Please watch for the next one. Um, it will be quite exciting seeing how I'm going into a door level from what you can see on the chart to your left. Uh, I believe that is the end of one of the stages, so please make sure not to miss it. Alright, well then, I will see you then.